This landmark of people and places made Huntington the natural choice for the premier summer contest held by the PSAA. You know, as I look back to the Huntington event, I can't help but think of Jim, the poor man Trenton, and what a great job he did of commentating the event. As a matter of fact, I'm supposed to call poor man with the afternoon surf report today. Kero QFM, the rock of the 80s, and that was Sex Dwarf by Soft Cell here on The Rock. And we're talking right now to Joey Baran. Joey, how's it going? Got your surf report for the day. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you know it. Anyways, right now I'm down here in Huntington Beach, uh, poor man, where you saw a lot of John Parman at the Terminator earlier this summer, and guess what? The Terminator has won it all. He is number one, that's right. It's been incredible, guy, because uh, I was just thinking back on the Grey Dog Grand Prix, the fact you had Noah Bedro, an unknown guy from Hawaii, just rip it up in all the events. I want to tell you, I really love the scene at the Huntington Pier, the Reverend Grey Dog, the Rip Curl event, and the women! Woo! It was the 10th of August. Another hot summer day was awakening on the north side of the pier. In the first light of day, a four to six foot swell beckoned the waiting competitors. Carl's bad veteran, David Bard. Huntington local, Jerry Boyd, stuffing it to the familiar surroundings. Rookie Frank Madrid. Resident pro Gary Clisby, who just a year earlier was injured seriously in a tragic car accident, showed the judges and everyone else that his ability and competitive spirit couldn't be held back as he just turned it on. Newport standout, John Gothard. Richie Rudolph. David Barr, well-defined, powerful turns. Sensational Hawaiian rookie Noah Bedro. Cleet Hamilton. Bedro up and over. Floridian, Bill Austin. Jerry Boyd. 